Hello and welcome back to another video. In this problem, we're told by graphing the function f of x is equal to cosine of 2x minus cosine of x divided by x squared, and zooming in towards the point where the graph crosses the y-axis, estimate the value of the limit as x approaches 0 of f of x. So I have the function graphed right here, and we can see that there's a pretty clear limit as x approaches 0. It's going to be down at this point right here. So all we have to do is zoom in and find the value of this point. At x at 0 itself, we're not going to have a value because we'd be dividing by 0, because 0 squared is 0 in the denominator. But as we get very, very close, we can see that it approaches negative 1.5. And then it's undefined, but that doesn't matter for the limit, because it just matters what it's going towards as we approach it. And the answer is negative 1.5. So A, our answer is the limit as x approaches 0 of f of x is equal to negative 1.5. B, we're asked to check our answer by evaluating f of x for values of x that approach 0. So if we take values of x and plug them into f of x, we get the following. So for values of x greater than 0, 0 0.1, 0 0.01, 0 0.001, Plugging them into our function, we get negative 1.493759, negative 1.499938, and negative 1.499999. So these values aren't approaching negative 1.5, but we have to check the other side with negative 0 0.1, negative 0 0.01, and negative 0.001. And these values are negative 1.493579, negative 1.499938, and negative 1.499999. So not only are these both approaching negative 1.5, but in fact, they're actually exactly equal to their negative counterparts. Not that that actually matters. The limit is the same either way. The limit as x approaches 0 of f of x is equal to negative 1.5.